Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Tanya. And if you're not, well, I'm back on YouTube and I'm so excited about it. And so I decided that I would dedicate my channel, since it's in Bellinis, just to modeling. Let's start from the beginning. Um, I have always wanted to be a model. I, it's always been in my mind, but I remember being like 14-ish. Uh, I was super tall, I was the tallest, even like taller than guys in my class, so I wanted to be a model. But at that time, I was doing ballet like 36 hours a week, I wanted to become a professional ballerina, and so I kind of had to make a choice, and I went for ballet, which I do not regret. Um, but yeah, ballet is over for me right now, I'm injured, it's never going to happen. Um, so now my shot. So basically... When I got injured and I pulled out from ballet, my sister gave me the idea of starting a blog or just something related to ballet to kind of stay into it. Some of you who have been following me for a while probably know my Instagram page, Dream of Ballet, which don't look for it, it doesn't exist anymore. Um, but basically, I started doing like dance modeling. And at the beginning, that was really not my goal. Like I was just having my boyfriend take pictures of me. Um, but slowly as my page was growing, I got companies reaching out asking me to model, I had photographers offer me to shoot for free and so yeah I started receiving a shit ton of leotards, point shoes, ballet shoes, like everything and so I started doing promotions on Instagram and yeah that's kind of my first real experience at modeling. So about a year and like three months ago or maybe a bit more I got offered a job in Barbados, so I literally put school on pause. Um, yeah, I'm very spontaneous and I like to just go for opportunities. So we left, uh, we moved to Barbados for a whole year and we just got back. So for the full year that I was there, I actually got into modeling and it was kind of an accident because um, there's this agency in Barbados that I reached out to or they reached out to me, I'm not sure, but I ended up signing with them and it was mainly like commercial work, so just like swimwear, beachwear, a bit of like runway if they had any like fashion shows or anything, but it was very casual. It wasn't like, there's nothing editorial, and so it was like a good way for me to test it and to see if I like it and if I'm able to, you know, perform. So yeah, so I just, I absolutely loved it. I was with that agency for a full year. I did commercials for hotels, I did for like nightclubs, restaurants, swimwear clothing stores, a bunch of things. Um, I'll maybe link some of the campaigns or put them on the screen so you guys can see some of the, like, the type of work I did in Barbados. But basically, a couple months before I moved back, I decided to look into modeling into Toronto. So I was like, I'm gonna try to get into a modeling agency there. I reached out to agencies um, online. So I went on their website, I filled out the forms, I used some shots that just like I was wearing exactly this, like just all in black with heels, no makeup on, hair tied back, and gap tip shots. And that's it. Like front, side, front smiling, side smiling. And that's it. And I also applied for a camp called the Coco Rocha Model Camp. So if you're interested in hearing more about the camp, I'll put the link to the camp down below so you can like read about it. Um, and I might do like a review video about it because I know a lot of people are kind of curious to know what I did um, and what the camp is like. But yeah, so I went there. I actually, I got in, I got accepted. I went to the camp. The camp was in September. So I moved back in August. A month later, went to the camp. And a week later, I got signed. So I was super happy. Got signed in Toronto and the agency accepted to be my mother agency, um, which means they're gonna help me try to get other agencies in other cities and try to, you know, move up to a level where I can be in a big agency and work internationally and basically be a model full time. So that's kind of the plan. So I hope you guys like are as excited as me. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and check out my Instagram. So I love you guys so, so, so much and I'm going to see you guys next week. Bye.